Hey everybody, welcome back to Let's Play Fable 2. I am your host, the Drunk Panda, and I am so sorry that it's been a week since the last time I recorded. Um, I've been a little busy with uh, school and stuff. I'm gonna walk. I'm gonna walk with you guys while when we up oh, bandits. What do you know? <laughs> See, this this hammer is much more powerful than our sword was. As you can see, we can kill people in like two hits. And there we go. And now we have brutal styles that we can access now. Hooray! Brutal styles. We now have flourishes. That's awesome. I like flourishes. Uh, basically, you charge, you charge going in a certain way, and voila. I believe that our dog found something. Oh, bandits! Let's get these all taken care of. Arg, stupid bandits! All taken care of. Hooray! All right, so let us head for. Uh, oh, we have more abilities available. Fantastic. Uh, we have time control and uh, chaos. Chaos is not that good of a move. Um, it basically it, it makes uh, it makes the the enemies do random things. So yeah. So let's finish our quest here. Let's go, and let's fast travel to the Temple of Light. Hooray! We'll, we'll finally get this quest taken care of. Loading Oakfield. Enter. Eating fruit and vegetables is not only healthy, blah, 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 blah. Check the Bowerstone bookstore for new publications and old volumes. You can also sell your unwanted books there. Hooray! So, yeah, we got more shit that we can sell at places. Uh. Oh, man. I am... I really gotta get used to everything again. It's been three minutes and I'm already... fucking tired. Alright then, so... Let's continue on to the Abbot. I'm pretty sure there's a job for you and voila! It's you! I prayed for your return. I heard what you did in Rookridge. All right. I think you it's could good. be of great use to us. All right. Awesome. Come, walk with me a while. All right. I'll walk with you. What do you want me to do? What do now, you want me to do? Nourishing the golden acorn is done with holy water from the well spring of light. Yeah. But the spring is located in a nearby cave, which is said to be quite dangerous. And you want me to go and protect Our sacred that? text protect says two monks must the enter this cave. The strongest and a second of the abbot's choosing. So I'm guessing you want me to protect the strongest. Obviously this concerns me, especially since the strongest monk here is my own child. That's fantastic. So instead of a second monk, I have chosen to send a protector for the first. And that's you, if you're interested. Well, I'm interested. The cave is just at the end of this road. Okay. Don't worry. I'll take care of it. You probably passed it on your way. We'll be waiting for you when you're ready. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Our first hero awaits us. Let's, let's Even go. If they do not yet realize it. And get our our first hero. Hooray! So let's get going. And there's probably beetles in the road again. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. Let's keep. Let's keep. Let's keep going. Ay -ay -ay. Oh, beetles! These are big beetles. Really big beetles. Well, fantastic. Do you hear that? The stalls are now opening. Not that. That. The sirens of Down by the reeds. Well then. Down by the reeds. Down by the reeds. 
Um, she's certainly a big one. Out to the seas. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's just get this over with. Ah, I knew my lovely singing voice would bring the crowds. Lovely. Yeah, sure. You're our monk. So you're my escort then. My father said you'd be coming by. Your? He's your father? What? Hey there, boy. Hello. Oh, you're a strong, handsome fellow, aren't you? I guess it is determined that better having you the dog is a boy, cave. yeah. Yes, I will. I'm Sister Hannah. Hannah? Some people call me Hammer when they think they're being clever. They're not. <laughs> but I can't do much about it because monks make a solemn vow never to bash anyone's face in. Well, Did my father mention that? Yeah. Whatever fighting's to be done in there, it's all yours. We require a hero, not a pacifist monk. Well said. We need her to find a reason to fight. I don't mind telling you, I'm a bit envious. You get all the excitement and I get to carry this bloody thing like some sort of mule. I mean, look at it. It's enormous. There it is. Golden or not, how much water does a bloody acorn need? Plenty, apparently. After you. All right, let's get going. Now, this is probably going to be the entirety of the video, taking care of this quest, which we've already we're already seven minutes in. So who knows how much longer it'll take? Probably more than ten minutes. Ah, uh, jeez. This is going to be a long episode. I just know it. All right, let's get going. been in here for maybe a hundred years well no monks anyway I guess an adventurer or two could have come in but if they got out alive I didn't hear about it Look up there. Ooh, pretty yes they are well then You are a quiet one. Nope. Watch your step, Dobby. Looks a bit steep here. Do you reckon we'll run into anything? My voice is just inner monologue. I mean, a dark, creepy cave is a hell of a place for a holy spring. Especially for an order of pacifists. Okay then. You know, I've heard of monks in the north who believe that to transcend violence, you have to understand it first. So instead of praying, they train to fight all day. They think that's the path to inner peace. Oh, cool. Sometimes I think, what if the bloke who founded the temple of that? Okay then. Well. All right. This should be the central chamber. Wow. I've never seen anything like this ever. Now, according to my father, we need to go through these three doors in order to collect the water. Putting weight on the pressure plates will open the doors. She's humongous, isn't she? This one's the first. There you go. Oh, hello, dog. Alright, let's get going. Luckily, I've got something unbelievably heavy right here. All we have to do is add a bit of water from the fountain that's in the room up ahead. Or at least it should be in the room up ahead. Steep in here as well. <laughs> this cave really is quite dangerous. Hannah does plenty of Not talking. Not in many caves. Bet you have heard of Once. Once. Treasure in that. More like Hobbs. What do you reckon's down there? In the dark, at the bottom? I don't know. Bodies, maybe. Bones. Uh. All the poor buggers who've taken a bad step. Way to make this so bright and sunny, Hannah. Alright, let's do this. Alright, so let's get the water flowing. Get up here. I stand here so I can catch it. 
and you need to stand on that one. Alright then. Whoa, Yay! There it goes. Oh yeah. I can feel this thing getting even heavier. That's nice, that is. Alright then. So far this isn't too bad. A couple of steep bits, but that's it. You talk too much. I really hope they find someone else to do this next time. Mind you, I'll be an old lady by then, so I'm probably off the hook. Yeah, probably. You know, this is probably going to be the highlight of my life. The day I carried a jug through a cave. Hardly epic poem stuff, is it? <laughs> Did you hear something? No. Probably just my imagination. Yeah, probably. Don't talk much, do you? No, I don't. Ooh, there's a silver key. I reckon that's all the water we're gonna get from this one. Yay, Sorky. Alright, let's get going. Let's get to the next area. What the Okay then. That's a little creepy. Nope. Ah, oh, come on! <laughs> okay, this is fun. This is plenty of fun. Uh, time to kill Hollow Men. All right then. Uh, yay. All right, let's get out of here. Hold on, first, gotta get the final spell. All right. Learned chaos! Hooray! More shit will happen! Ugh! 13 minutes already. Uh, more like... No, no, no. Alright, come on, Hannah. That was fantastic! Those things didn't stand a chance! Have you ever fought them before? No, I have not. It sure looked like you had. That or you're a very fast learner. Well, yeah, that might be. I don't see any wisps now. And no hollow men followed us. Nope. Guess we're safe in here. I suppose so. Now hurry up and get on the next panel. All right. All right, let's go to the second room. And here it we go. This is going to be fun. Right. Here's the next one. I'll stand by the fountain to catch the water, same as before. All right, then. Hurry up and get on the get on the fountain plate. All right, there we go. Ah, oh, brilliant. Just have to wait until this thing stops running. You think they would have made this jug with a flat bottom in case you want to have a rest? But as it is, it would just tip over, and then where would it be? Oh, Father, here they come! Alright, fortunately, I know the perfect spell to deal with Hollow Man. Hey, that spell just made my skin prickle! All we have to do is wait for more Hollow Men. And voila. Where did you 
And voila. More shit. Alright, let's try with a gun now. No, I don't. Uh, this would be so much easier if I had a better weapon. I really hate using guns in this in this part. Uh. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. All right, the jug's almost completely filled. Come on. Wow, I've never seen someone do that before. You just saw me do it like a dozen times. To come back to life. Full. Back to the central chamber then. All right, let's get out of here. All right, let's go. Let's go. All right, hurry up. That took three minutes. What in the world was that? Um, Are you ready for whatever that was? I didn't hear anything. Alrighty then. Looks like the door's starting to open. Where on earth? And then I got stuck. Hey, come back. Who knows what's on the other side? Uh Angel. You think he's alright? Yeah, he'll be fine. Okay. I'm getting worried now. He would have yelped out if he was if he got hurt. And here he comes. Here comes the doggy. What you got there, boy? What you got there? Um Ugh, that is disgusting. That's a hollow man head. Okay then. <laughs> Attacking him? Who's a good boy? Who tears their heads off hollow men? <laughs> Is it you? Is it you, boy? Indeed he does. Quite a companion you've got. Remind me not to let him lick me again. <laughs> Shall we? Alright, let's get going. One more room one more fountain to go. Alright. Let's get going. Oh, hello. Oh, jeez. Good thing I can't hurt uh, Hannah. Otherwise, she would have been a little pricked by now. Indeed I am. Well, I hate Hollow Man. Especially in Fable 3. They're annoying in Fable 3. Oh jeez. Right. Oh my. Well then. Oh, come on. Oh crap. Son of a I didn't want to get knocked out this playthrough. Alright, let's just burn him. And there we go. Wow, that was amazing. You killed the and now we've learned you. the next level of magic for force push. All right then, force push, level two. Uh. I was really 
really worried for a moment there. Well, for several moments. I'm no shit. <laughs> no shit, I was. Fortunately, there's no more hollow men, so we're good. This is it. This is the final room. Should be nearly done now. I know I said that before, but hopefully this time it's true. All right then. I think that's the last play over there. Lords of Light, bless this water, that with it we may give rise to new life once more. Okay then. As new life rises, so shall we. Fantastic. Um. Hello? What? 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 Um. What's going on? Hello? What's going on? Is there anybody there? Hello? I see a statue. Shadow thing. There's a statue over there too. Um Sister Hannah. Okay then. Brother Robin? What is it? It's your father. One of Lucian's men. He's holding him hostage at the temple. Uh He's got a gun. Oh jeez. That can't be good. I have to save my father. Oh, wow. Come on. We have to get to the temple. All right, I'm coming, I'm coming. One of Lucian's agents has come to the temple. Go after her. All right, I'm coming, I'm coming. Ay ay ay. Stop by the jug. Ay 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 ay. Oh, gee, gee, gee. What am I doing? 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 What's going on? <laughs> That's funny. Uh, okay then. Treasure? Treasure? Ooh, treasure. Let's get this treasure chest first. Treasure is more important than plot! Ooh, an emerald. That's useful. Alright, we gotta go help Hannah. Ay, ay, ay. Come on. What would a soldier want with our father? Are you okay? All right then. Oh, hello. Men. You're coming with me, or he dies. Like hell I am. You let him go before I break you in half. No! Hey. Ugh, that can't be good. Don't make me kill you too. Oh, oh wow. Well then. I could have stopped him before <laughs> Wow. I'm sorry, Father. Not that I broke my vow. I'm sorry I didn't break it sooner. I never did fit in at this place. We both knew that. Well then. And now I'm making a new vow. Lucian will die for what he did to you. I won't break this one. Sister Hannah, the blessing. Um. You do it. As new life rises, so shall we. As the seed returns to the earth, so do we all. Well then. Well, my father's gone. The golden oak is flourishing again. So now life just goes on as before, does it? Well, maybe. 
The other monks may believe that, but your eyes have been opened. Where did you come from? Who are you? She's not important. Someone who can tell you much about Lucian. Where he is, what his plans are, and how you can gain your revenge. If you will listen. I want to know everything. All right, then. Then come with me, Sister Hannah. Call me Hammer. Well, then. That's fantastic. I've taken Hammer to the guild. You've done well, hero. You have gathered the first of the three heroes. And we are one step closer to defeating Lucian's plans. It will take some time for Hammer to overcome her grief. And longer to explain her role in Lucian's downfall. Perhaps this would be a good time to upgrade your equipment. I believe there is a sale in Bowerstone. It may well be worth a visit. Come back to the guild when you are ready. Alright then. So, that is the end of this episode, everybody. In the next episode, we're going to be continuing on to Bowerstone and hopefully figuring out what our next plan will be. I'll see you guys in the next one.